Hello, everybody. You are listening to Around the World. I'm Violette, and today my team and I are going to present you a very interesting country. But now we have a guest, Mr. Rolak. Hi, Mr. Rolak. How are you today? Fine, and you, Violette? Fine, thank you. So, first, Munir is going to do a general presentation of the country. Then you are going to listen to Eric, who will present some special features. The next person is Naila. She will talk about food. Finally, Ibrahima will introduce for you one famous people of the country. Secondly, here is a riddle. Mr. Rolak, you have to guess our mystery country. I will give you five clues. First clue, I am a Commonwealth realm of the United Kingdom. No, I have no clue so far. Okay. Second clue, my governor general is Patrick Allen. Not, not yet, no. Sorry. Okay. Third clue. I am one of the Caribbean islands. Still nothing? Uh, no. Okay. Next clue. My capital is Kingston. Oh, yeah. Now it's too easy. It's uh, Jamaica. Yes. All right. Well done. It's Jamaica. Mm. All right. Munir, tell us about our awesome island. Jamaica, a heavenly island. Like the majority of Caribbean islands, Jamaica is a real Eden garden. The third greatest island in the greater Antilles capitals, Kingston, is the most populated city in this country. Jamaica is a commonwealth realm of the United Kingdom. The current head of state is Sir Patrick Allen, the Governor General. This little island is moderately populated with 268 persons per square kilometer, according to the statistics of 2016. The local currency is the Jamaican dollar. Jamaica has a tropical climate because of its thick forests. Jamaica is famous worldwide because of its reggae music, Bob Marley being its most re illustrious representative, and also in St. Bolt, the fastest athlete in the world. Fine. Before we continue, the breaking news. Radio Mermoz, la radio qui vous libère. First, the First Minister, Edouard Sega, who was hospitalized for an undisclosed aliment, has been treated for serious illnesses. He is now in good spirits. Killing mystery. Pol police don't find him responsible of a lot of murders. They only find one of three Spanish town victims died from gunshot wounds. Nine miles in Blue Bay, St. Andrews, is becoming a virtual ghost town. Residents have been fleeing the East River St. Andrew community that has been rocked by deadly intermittent violence for decades. Radio Mermoz, à la recherche de la vérité, la vraie. Thank you everybody. Eric, give us some special features of Jamaica. First, I am going to talk about Jamaica's natural features. Jamaica is the fifth most biodiverse country in the world. In the different national parks, we can find more than 800 species of endemic plants, 200 species of endemic birds, 30 spe species of endemic reptiles, and 21 species of endemic frogs. The Blue Mountains is the longest mountain range in Jamaica. The Blue Mountain Peak, which is part of the Blue Mountain Range, is 2,256 meters tall. You can go hiking there from Kingston to see the beautiful view. Now, I'm going to talk about the, some of Kingston's features. In Kingston, the capital and the biggest city of the country, there's a royal botanical garden, Hope Garden. There are a lot of different plant species there, such as spice species and mango trees. In this beautiful garden, we can also see the hibiscus elatus which is the national tree of Jamaica. In this huge city, there is also a manor dating from 1881, Devon House. It was home of the first black millionaire in Jamaica, George Chibble. Today, you can vis visit this house as a tourist, and very good ice creams are also sold there. Wow, it looks amazing. Naila, what can we eat there? I will introduce you to the Jamaican national dish, Akian Salfish. 
Aki is a fruit imported from Ghana before 1725. Aki is another name for the Akan tribe. The fruits turn from green to bright red to yellow orange. Today, Aki fruit is kind and one of Jamaica's major export. Salfish is salcoal which has been preserved by drying after salting. To prepare the dish, salcoal is sauteed with boiled aki, onions, papers. It can be garnished with bacon and tomatoes and, is, and it is usually served as breakfast or dinner. Miam, it seems delicious. Ibrahima, which celebrity came from Jamaica? Hi everyone, I'm going to introduce Bob Marley. Bob Marley is born on February 1, 1944. He is considered as one of the best singers of all the world. He is the one who popularized the reggae because before him, reggae was all, all known in Jamaica only. For Jamaican, he is a symbol of peace. He is the singer the most known of all the planet. He has been shot one time in Kingston. Hopefully, he survived. But a few years after, Bob is dead of a cancer in Miami. Vous en avez marre de devoir marcher pour aller à l'école Qui plus est avec un sac qui pèse 3 tonnes Eh bien n'attendez plus et achetez les sacs à dos, sacs à dos vol. Des sacs qui ont la capacité de déployer une fusée qui vous élèvera dans les airs. Plus besoin de marcher Bonne nouvelle, c'est vraiment pas cher du tout. Cela vous rajoutera juste 2 kilos en plus sur le dos, mais c'est rien. Achetez sac à dos vol et décollez vers la réussite. Thank you, Ibrahima. Mr. Rolak, we have a few questions for you now. Okay. Uh, Mr. Rolak, yes. do you know some songs of Bob Marley? Uh, some, yes. Can you sing one, please? S sing one, or oh, I'm a pretty bad singer, so I don't know, maybe No Woman No Cry. No Woman No, no cry. cry. That's about it. Thanks. <laughs> You're welcome. According to our presentation, Would you prefer to visit Kingston or the Blue Mountains? You know, actually, I've already been to Jamaica, and I uh, just, uh, I think Blue Mountain, I would rather go to Blue Mountain because it's, uh, it's not as crowded as uh, Kingston. So, yeah, that's what I would choose. Have you ever tasted Jamaican food? Yes, and especially the coffee. We generally say that the Blue Mountain coffee is, uh, is excellent. Is actually, it's very expensive, and I don't find it so, so good, actually. Have you ever been in Jamaica? Yes, I've been once uh, for a wedding and uh, for vacations, and uh, I found uh, this place uh, very nice. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you for listening to our program, and thank you very much, Mr. Rolak, for being our guest. Thanks to you.